Hey guys, this is Aaron Hunt. Welcome to Shadowrun Vineyards. It's harvest season, and today we're out on the crush pad processing the grapes that were harvested from our vineyard this morning. So what we're doing here, this is a sorting table. So a uh, quick recap, the grapes come out of the vineyard and they get dumped into these uh, bins on their, uh, on their stems in cluster and they get dumped into the big hopper up here. Um, there's an auger in there that pushes them out of the hopper, drops them here into the sorter destimmer, or destimmer I guess, which shoots the stems out the back and the grapes drop right here. And then we have a vibrating sorting table. The idea is that all the junk that's not supposed to go in the wine should fall out through these little slats. Um, we also lose a lot of juice, which is good. We want to get rid of some of that juice because we want a higher percentage of, of grape skin mass to, uh, to juice for a more intense extracted wine. Um, as you can see, the fruit looks really clean. There's not a lot of work for us to do. There are these, you know, stems that, you know, we pull out, but they're not a big deal. Grapes, we pull, um, uh, leaves rather, we pull out because they don't contribute a lot to the flavor. Um, the big thing to look out for is jacks. And jacks are little, little green grapes. Um, like here's one. And ideally these will all fall out through the slats or we'll pull them out because these are acid bombs. They're full of acid. Uh, and flavors that we don't want going into the wine. Um, the next step for this, normally uh, we'd put it on dry ice and we'd do a cold soak for two or three days, which means we're extracting uh, color out of the grapes into the juice. In this case, because there's some smoke on the berries from a big fire we had, uh, we're gonna go ahead and start fermentation right now to limit that smoke flavor getting into the wine. Um, so yeah, this is about full. Um, we're going to hit it with SO2, which means um, we're going to hit it with something that's going to stop the native yeast from doing their thing, and it's going to knock back any bacteria that might be in there. Um, and then we're going to hit it with the commercial yeast that we want to, to do the work of fermentation. And, um, and then it's, it's going to do its thing. The yeast are going to do their work and eat all the sugar and turn it into alcohol. And then we're going to have something that's going to be ready to be pressed in the big press behind you. And then it's going to go into barrel, and then it's going to going to do its thing. It's uh, it's elevage. It's going to um, rest and turn into something we can bottle. So that's a process. Um, and so far, it all looks pretty good. We're happy with this. All right. So as we're processing these grapes, uh, we're going to be getting more or less juice flowing out of the grapes, depending on how mushy they are. And that juice flows into these trays, and the trays capture jacks and everything that the sorting table is supposed to capture and supposed to pull out of there. And it's, it's dumping juice out. Uh, we call this the Sanye. It's a juice that just runs out. Um, up here, I've got a valve and I'm guessing I'm going to get a lot. Um, so that's all juice we're going to get rid of. Um, and what's important is to keep track of how much juice you get rid of. Um, this juice here, you know, I mean, it's got pretty nice color but um, it is mostly sugar and water and so we're going to dump it because we want to take out sugar and water and we want a higher percentage of grape skins to liquids so this is going to get tossed i just have to keep track of um, of how much i toss and it's always kind of a bummer to dump out stuff you could drink but uh, I think that adds up to four gallons I've dumped so far today. And that'll go into the ultimate math. And then we'll dump more. We'll pump more out uh, using some winemaking tools um, to keep this process going and to, to minimize the amount of liquid in there. But you got to have some liquid. You need something to sell. So. All right, gallons five and six. We really should be making punch or juice or something out of this because it's delicious. But um, we've got other stuff to keep us busy. Can you help him on this one? It's not, it's not it's too bad. bad. It's just kind of awkward. Yeah. You got it, big guy? Yep. And just set it on sand. Yeah. Okay. Looking good. Mm -hmm. 